Tell a friend to tell a friend that do it all haul is in. And we're back with another NBA 2K24 next gen beer video. And today I have a special beer for you guys. Now, I don't know if you would consider this beer rare, but um, I've probably seen like one of these beers since the game been out. Um, I know people have them, but I really don't see them in the wreck or anything like that. So we have the break starter. Like I said, this is rare. It's, it's rare to me because I don't see it that much. I mean, I know about the beer, but I don't see it that much. You know what I'm saying? So choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go any further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. There's a like button time, and I need you guys to go down there and hit that like button. Get this video to 100 likes. And if you haven't already, hit the link in the description to join the Discord. Hit the link in the description to follow me on Twitch. As you can see, we're going with the center position. Six foot seven for the height. Six foot seven centers are are a thing now. So um, if you don't like them, you just don't. It's up to you. You can go six eight if you want to. That's totally up to you. We're going 246 on the weight, seven four on the wingspan. Let's get into it. So we're going to go ahead and start with the finishing now. Y'all know how I do, man, with the finishing. I love standing dunk. I love post control. And I just be trying to put y'all on game. A lot of people don't listen to it, but I be putting it out there so you guys can get it and go try it out for yourself and not just look at the bill and automatically just say the bill is trash because a lot of people do that and they don't even go try it out. So we're going to put the post control at 85, which is good in my opinion. Gold drop, step a gold, post spin. Um, two great bats to have, especially when you are in the post. If anybody want to come down there and try you, you're going to put that elbow in their chest. You're going to go up for an easy two. For the standard dunk, now you can do this at, at an 85 if you want to. It's totally up to you. But I wanted to take it a step further and go to a 92 because a 92 does give me that fast twitch, as you can see, on gold. A lot of people just stop at a 90. I don't understand why you don't want that fast twitch on gold. Now, if you take your close shot up to a 90, you can get it on gold, but that's a lot. You know what I'm saying? I would say uh, put that standard dunk up, and we took it to a 92. No, we don't get the big man contact dunk, but we're not worried about that at all. Okay, and as you can see, we do get um, a 52 driving dunk, 32 on the layup, 57 on the close shot. Um, don't look at it and be like, oh, that ain't going to work. It will work. Trust me. Okay, but let's go down to the um, physicals right quick. So for the speed, we have 80 speed. That's going to be faster than the majority of the centers that you face. Acceleration, 73, which is pretty good. Strength, oh my goodness, 95 strength. Um, gold back down punisher, Hall of Fame removable, gold brick wall, gold bulldozer. Vertical, y'all know we got to get that to an 80. So we come back up. As you can see, we do get everything I said we're getting and a little bit more. As you can see, we also get area wizard and precision dunk on gold. You can get some good dunk packages with this 50. But let's go ahead and get to the green bean, make your girl scream bad. This build does have some three-point shooting, but it's um, it's a break starter. So you can't get a three-point shot too high or else it would change the name of the build. So in order for us to keep the name of the build, we're going to keep the three-point shot at a 77. And that's okay. You know, it's not the best, but, you know, it's a rare build. So when I say rare build, just think about the three-point shooting is not going to be that high. And on this build, you can see that it's not going to be that high because we do have it at the 77. Okay, now on the mid-range side, you can leave it right there at the 62, or you can take it to a 76. And a 76 don't give you um, extra uh, jump shot animations or anything like that, but it does give you green machine and space creator on silver. So that's a good thing, right? And that's what we got. So we got silver catch and shoot. We got silver green machine, space creator, spot finder, guard up. Meet a magician, open looks, uh, post fade, feed numb, dream shake. So we have a lot of silver badges on this field that will allow us to go out there and do what we need to do. We got bronze blinded, we got bronze dead out, so that's good too. And you will be able to make the occasional three. Just don't be out there, uh, you know, playing crazy and try just jacking up shots or whatever. Now you want to take good shots with this build. You want to have all your high zones lethal if you can, um, and shoot from those lethal zones if you um, want to make more threes. You know what I'm saying? And have somebody pass you the ball that got good passing, so you can get a good catch animation too. That plays a lot into how you shoot as well. I know a lot of people say that, and you know sometimes even with a bad pass. If you got high shooting, man, you shouldn't make that excuse. You know what I'm saying? But a lot of people do. But it is what it is. But let's go ahead and get into the sauce. But before we do, <clears throat> excuse me, before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody and their mama can see this video. And I need everybody and their mama to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. Now, with the passing on this bill, we wanted to make sure that we get the name break started. Now, you can get that at an 84, okay? And that will give you the name, but why not take it up to an 86 and get gold break started because you will be the center for your team. You will be able to get the rebound and kick the ball up the court. Now, if you want to bail out, take it up to an 87. That's totally up to you, but this is what we have. 
okay as far as the uh, ball handler we're not necessarily worried about that um you can you know go in there and change that if you want to but it only go to a well you can't change it i forgot about that you you can't change it because it went up to a 80 i mean it went up to a 51 because of the pass accuracy so uh, that's what we got with the um with the passing and that's what we have with the speed with ball and the ball handle so we're not necessarily out there trying to dribble we get the rebound we kick the ball up the court and we go from there you know we don't go out there trying to do too much a lot of people want to dribble all the time but it's not all about dribbling all the time you know you want to make sure that you secure the rebound and you get the ball up the court to your teammates and that's very important now let's get to the defense so what will make this build different to me is the fact that you can guard multiple positions i'm talking about the center Power forward, small forward, shooting guard, point guard. It don't matter. You have good defense on this build. So with the interior defense, we're going to get that up to an 82. And that does give us, um, uh, 82 does give us post lockdown on silver. And we're going to take that block up to an 87. That does give us a gold chase down artist. We have silver anchor. We're going to have gold pogo as well. So you will be able to jump up and block some shots with this build. You have good vertical. Um, you're not too heavy. Um, you know, you can, you can be an athletic build. That's what it built to be. Okay, perimeter defense, we're going to take that up to 85 because we don't want people just running by us on the perimeter. So this is optional. You, you don't have to do this. If you don't want to, it's up to you. Um, but why not? You know what I'm saying? Make this be a versatile. Make this be a be able to go out there and guard anybody. Simple as that. So we do get silver clamps. We do get silver 94 feet. We got anchor braces, challenger, fast feet, pick dodger. Um, and for the steel, we're going to take that to a 91. You can take to an 85 if you want to to get silver gloves, silver intercept, and silver right stick ripper. But we're going to take it to a 91 to get gold glove, gold intercept, and gold right stick ripper. I think that's a little bit better combination for the people out there that like to reach. And it's just something about that gold glove, gold intercept, man. It just make you feel a little bit more comfortable reaching as opposed to the silver. Now, silver is, is good. Don't get me wrong. It will get the job done. But that 91 is on another level. 87 block, like I said, we do get gold chase down artists, and Pogo is going to go up too. So with the rebound, we're gonna max the well, we're gonna max the off, I mean max the defense out and take the offense to a 77. So we got gold, uh, Pogo, post playmaker, rebound chaser, and um, Hall of Fame box out beat. So if you get the ball in the post with this build, you can kick it out and use that post playmaker too. Okay, 80 speed, 73 acceleration, 95 strength, 80 on the vert, and the rest is on stamina. Now let's get into these shades up. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now we do have shades of David Coins. We got Bob. Bob. We got Bam Adebayo, and we have Nas Reed. <clears throat> Excuse me. And the build is a break starter. Let me know in the comments what you what you like about the build, and let me know if it's rare to you. Okay, I'm out of here. Ciao.